The beekeeping story of the Institute of Rural Entrepreneurship Nkame. A honeybee plays two major and vital roles in the balance of our ecosystem. First, in the multiplication and propagation of plant species by helping in a process called pollination, which leads to fertilization and formation of seeds which grow to new plants. The bee does this as it moves from one plant to the other, gathering pollen and nectar for processing honey. Therefore, it plays a great role in environmental conservation and protection. Secondly, honey has a high nutritional and medicinal value. Other products of bee farming such as wax and propolis are of great economic importance. Therefore, given the economic and environmental value of beekeeping, it is right and fitting that we should teach the young people and farmers to engage in bee farming or apiculture. Here is the story of our pedagogic apiary. It all started in the 16th of February 2016 by the visit of Elsa de Molin, the project manager of Mil Meyer Honing, a Belgian NGO. She came and talked to us about the beekeeping project. This was followed by a series of seminars and training sessions in Yaoundé and Kambe. Mr. Dinga Joseph came into the scene as the project manager of Mir Maya Honing for the Proceva platform to pilot the project in Cameroon. Very importantly, Mr. Nchom Wilfred, the technical coordinator of beekeeping for the Diocese of Kumbo, held a series of meetings with local beekeepers of Kambe and the training team of the Institute of Rural Entrepreneurship. Concrete action started in October 2017 with the purchase of beekeeping equipment, preparation of the pedagogic apiary and construction of hives. Hives were installed in November 2017 with the assistance of Nchom Wifred and some local bee farmers. By January 2018, eight hives out of 12 were colonized and in March 2018, all the hives were colonized. In May 2018, we did the first harvest and extraction, producing 5 liters of honey, even though the harvest was late as most of the hives had brood. This has not gone without some challenges. For example, we had wildfires. Our apiary is linked to a vast surrounding bush, therefore we face a danger of wildfire. We did the fire tracing and it has helped a lot. Stray animals. This is a grazing area for cows, goats, sheep, horses, and human beings who search for wood or who come purposely to steal honey. We are constructing a fence in a bit to stop any trespassing. Pests. There are some crickets and spiders that infest the hives in order to steal honey or kill bees. We are trying to fight against these pests by regularly visiting the hives and driving them away or using magic chalk fear of bee sting. Being learners, we are afraid of bees, especially during harvesting. As we are getting into it, the fear is fading away and the activity is getting more interesting. We have learned to be gentle and friendly with bees. Apiculture in the Institute of Rural Entrepreneurship in Kambi is indeed a successful project. 